Мы представляем школу английского языка Green Forest. Меня зовут Амуна. И второй преподаватель, который будет сегодня вести со мной, ее зовут Таня. Очень Таня. приятно. Окей. Okay. So, guys, today we are going to talk about past and past habits. Things we did and we used to do when we were little. Or maybe just not little, but that happened in the past. And that is why. A little fun information about us. So here you can see two pictures, yeah? All right. One picture. Oh, okay. Who are these people in the pictures? <laughs> Tamuna. Okay. Oh, that's right. Good job. Yeah, that's good. Where is Tamuna? <laughs> Left or Both. right? Both of them? Oh, no, no, no. no. <laughs> Choose on one right. picture. Right. Yes. Okay. Okay. Who is the second person? Maybe you. Oh, maybe. Oh, yeah. maybe. <laughs> I, yeah, so I look not the same. That's okay. good. So oh, yes. guys, do you see any difference between our old pictures age. and us today? Age. Okay. okay. Yes. We're In older. the appearance, do we have any differences? So you couldn't guess that it was me. Why? Not much. Not much. Not Not much. much. Nothing has changed. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. So the same. If I look at my... Oh, no, let's look at Tamuna's picture. Yes? All right. So do what has changed? What has she's changed? Taller. Okay. She's taller now. Yes. What yes. else? She has legs. She can walk. <laughs> I used to have short hair and now I have long, long hair. Long hair. Right, you can see, but I have long hair. Believe yes. me. <laughs> so, she didn't used to have long hair, mm -hmm. but now she does, yes. We can see, but she we, shows yes. That. Okay, if we look do. at my picture, yeah. Uh, it's a little bit harder, but what has changed? Everything. Everything. <laughs> what do you think? How old was I at this picture? Maybe three. Uh, less. It was, I was about one year old, so, yeah. But oh, a lot of things have changed. Yeah, a lot of, yes, I hope so. Right. And I'll give you a example. hint. Cheeks. <laughs> yes, and she was like this, and now she's like... Slimmer. Slimmer. Okay. All right, slimmer. slimmer. A little bit slimmer. Okay, that is why I can say that. I used to be plump, a little bit plump, yes. Not fat. Plump. Uh -huh. uh, but now I'm quite slim. I hope so that I'm slim and not plump anymore. But anyway, <laughs> something has changed. Uh All right. So, guys, when we talk about something, some situations and some uh, habits or things that used to happen in the past, that happened for many times. What please. structure yeah. do we need to use? Take a look at these sentences. What structure did we use here? Just to Okay, right. mm -hmm. used to. If we look at the example with me, with mm -hmm. Tanya, uh, is it positive sentence or negative sentence? Positive. 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 So right. we used here... Used to? Plus what? Plus ing or plus second form? Or, or plus infinitive? Bear infinitive. Bear infinitive, also that's right. Used to be. plus bear infinitive. If we look at the negative example, didn't used to and so on. Uh, so how do we form it? What do what we do need we for negative it? sentence? What's new in this sentence? Didn't. didn't that's right. Helping verb. Uh -huh. Question. I have a question to guys. Why we use didn't there? Why I can't say uh, Tamuna not used to have long hair? It sounds good. In the past. That's right. It happened in the past. Yes. Okay. That's why we use a helping verb, uh, which is did and didn't when we make a negative sentence, and we say didn't use, and use will be used or use. Infinitive for past. You yes. Didn't plus infinity. That's yes, right. Because didn't we remember, to. if mm -hmm. we have helping her did, ed, it takes everything. Yes, no ed, nothing. We have did. It shows us that it is past tense. Mm -hmm. Okay, very nice. Let's. And again, plus infinity. Yes. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Right now, you will help us a little bit. Okay, guys. So, uh, if I want to say that in the past I played the piano, but now I don't play the piano anymore, mm -hmm. Sasha. What can I say? What in the think? past you played piano. I played piano in the past, now I don't play it anymore. Mm -hmm. I used to now? Play. Yes. Yes, yes, say it. Okay. I used to play. I used to play the piano. piano. That's mm -hmm. right. Well, when I was 10. Now, do I play it now? No. No, no I don't. Okay. How do we know it? Because you say so. Uh, <laughs> yes, first of all, because I said so. But if I just say, I used to play the piano when I was 10. Mm -hmm. How do you understand that I don't play piano anymore? You look at the sentence and you look at the form used to. If you have used to, it means that it happened in the past and it doesn't happen anymore. Okay, mm -hmm. that's that word helps you. All right, okay. the next one. Uh, I want to say that in the past I didn't drink coffee. What do I say? I didn't used to drink coffee. All right. Mm -hmm. 
I didn't use to drink coffee a few years ago. What about now? I drink coffee. Yes, she drinks I coffee. I drink That's coffee. right. Uh -huh. Yes, maybe every day, every morning. Mm -hmm. Yes. Do you drink coffee, guys? Yes. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. If I want to ask Tamuna uh -huh. whether she learned English at school, oh, she didn't learn English in school. What question do I ask? How do we start our question? I want to ask whether she learned English at the school. Did you Did you, you, right. you used to? Used to? Uh -huh. Aha, perfect. Did you use to study, to study English when you were at school? Awesome. So if I want to form the question, what do I do? Helping verb, used to. What do I do? You change. Change the places. The places. That's, That's right. It. So what is the first? Helping verb or used to? Helping. Helping verb. Then we have uh, subject. subject and then we have a verb. That's right. Well, we have here. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the most important, don't forget that if you have did, we don't need ed. Did you use to study English at school? By the way, guys, did you use to study English at school? Yes. Yes. We're supposed to. Uh, not all of us. Some people studied German. Some people yes, studied French, so. yes. All right. Well, uh, so used to. When we talk about something that happened in the past, for one time or for many times? What do you think? Many times. Regularly. Many times. Regularly. That's Ooh, right. For we many say, times. Mm -hmm, we can mm -hmm. say that it, is, it was a repeated action in that the happened past. in the past. That's why we can say that. Habits and states that we had in the past and which we don't have right now. Okay? okay. Go and learn English. Practice right. English. Enjoy speaking English. Uh -oh. Where did it go? Must have bypassed your phone and flown right out of the window. Oh well, how can I tell? Should I call the operator? Or maybe she know the info. Or we're the wrong knots. If my message you got was too much or a lot to reply. Well, I try this for a fact. Well, should you ever come back? I'd relax and be relieved of all my panic attacks. Uh -oh.